So in the last five years, the MTV Video Music Awards has not gotten more than 7 million viewers. Okay. So they've not progressed. So if it wasn't for these stunts by A-list celebrities, would the Video Music Awards even be relevant? Mm. Let me see if you know any of these songs. Go ahead. Video of the Year, Little Nas X, Montero. I know who Little Nas X is, but Montero. Montero, yeah, is the is the name of the That's song. That's not. Call me when you want. Call yeah. me when you need. Call me in the morning. I'll be on the way. Right. Yeah, I know that That's song. the one. So that was Video of the Year. Okay. Well, uh, it's obviously, wild. obviously, you know from our trip to Charlotte. Mm-hmm. Who won Artist of the Year? Uh, Justin Justin Bieber. Justin because, Bieber. Because his stuff was all over. What was that? Like, what was five that? songs in a row. Play. What was that? What were we listening to? Pandora. Pandora. Yeah. Yeah. They had to change the whole genre because he was like, okay, this That's is like five songs well, Justin, Justin Bieber. Bieber song we've heard. Right. That's good. I'm glad song, you got Artist of the Year. Though. Song of the Year was Driver's License by Olivia Rodrigo. And she won yeah. Best New Artist. That's the girl that was discovered off of TikTok. Yeah, I don't know. She's like, I'll drive along past your street. Oh, yeah, that one? That's the that's the song of the year, guys. The stalker song, yeah. I'm oh. pretty sure. Is that it? And then Best Travis Rap Lessons. Song was Travis Scott Franchise. You know what? I don't know that. I don't know that franchise. I, I know I Travis Scott. Up, I pulled it up and listened to it earlier. It's garbage. Really? Like, legit. It's garbage. Didn't Travis Scott do that song that we like? What was Swaco? That high song? The highest in the room song? Oh. Yeah. Uh, I like that song. Yeah, that was five years ago. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was not. Was it really? Dang. So, okay. Well, I my mean, thing is MTV doesn't really play music, music have you seen, videos anymore. Have you seen any of those music videos? I had, did see Lil Nas X music video. Okay. Because they were, it was so controversial. All right. Controversial, whatever. Because it was like worshiping the devil mm-hmm. or whatever. So yeah, I did see that one. Brief snippets of it. But I don't look up music videos anymore, really. Like. Mm. So you think it's just that the music video has gone? Or that MTV's not playing music videos anymore? Or do you think that people just look at their music videos on YouTube? That. People look at music videos on YouTube. And so MTV's got to come up with something else to be competitive, basically? I mean, we don't even get the MTV channel, so... I feel like a lot of people don't really use cable like that anymore. Everything is streaming. Yeah, and they were already phasing out music videos from MTV like 15 years ago. Like where they were only on at like midnight or they were only on like... Just to fill time? Yeah, to fill time. It wasn't like... They would have TRL, like the countdown or whatever every day. But they started filling that with reality TV shows instead of music videos. Right. And now when they play music videos, there are t- channels that play music videos, but they're not from MTV. They're just like old videos that play to fill a channel. So, anyways. I don't know. I don't so watch... feel like the VMAs are irrelevant? I just think it's a tradition, just like in small towns, they have the same events every year. Right. And the same old people go to them only. And they just like... You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just something that they've done every year as a tradition. So, they don't like to do anything different. I feel like that's kind of what MTV has kind of become. Hmm. Like, it's a traditional thing. It's not a relevant thing. Like, you know what I mean? Hmm. Only a select people really, like, tune in and attend that anymore. Unless they're getting awarded something. Right. Right. I feel like basically the only celebrities that were there were nominated. Right. You know. Mm-hmm. So, like I said, I think it's a traditional thing that they're just keeping up with. I'm Nate. And I'm Meredith. 
And this is the So What You Want to Talk About podcast. So what you want to talk about? Make sure you like. Comment. Subscribe. Share with a friend. Thank you for following along. Check out InsterSale.com where we uh, sell custom t-shirts. Check out Sin's Crunchy Jerky. Get you some crunchy jerky. And make sure you get, pick up a copy of Meredith's book, London in the Googly Goo. Available on Amazon. Thank you for making her a best-selling author. Woo-woo. Thanks, guys. And we'll see you in episode two.